I remember when I was being bar mitzvahed, my grandfather, he always used to call me and when he visited, he would always uh, ask me if I was ready for my bar mitzvah and if I was excited for my bar mitzvah and how he was very excited to be a part of, uh, of my bar mitzvah. Well, my grandfather was never bar mitzvahed. He unfortunately didn't make it to my bar mitzvah and uh, he passed away about a year uh, before. And what makes this day so very special for me is you are sharing this day with my father, your grandfather, and who not only will be present for your bar mitzvah, but he will be joining you up on the bima and uh, being bar mitzvah himself because he was never bar mitzvah. And uh, this, this, uh, this is a wonderful bond. Uh, well, the bond was already there, but uh, just watching you two uh, together is really going to give me a kick. So uh, uh, have fun. This, this is really, if you think about it, this is what Judaism is all about. T to be able to share our Torah, our heritage, and to pass it from generation to generation. There's a beautiful teaching. You know, there, there are actually two Talmuds in Judaism. There's the Babylonian Talmud and the Palestinian Talmud. They usually agree on everything, but they had an interesting disagreement. The Babylonian Talmud said the greatest joy in the world is to see a grandfather teaching Torah to his grandson. That that's paradise. That was the Babylonian Talmud. Then the Palestinian Talmud said something slightly different. They said, no, the greatest joy is, see, is to see a grandson teaching Torah to his grandfather. I guess that. <laughs> so I think the truth is we're seeing both of that today that in a way you've each inspired one another to make this day holy, to make it meaningful, to make it wonderful.